Hello again everybody and welcome back to the channel. In today's video I'm going to be giving you an update of what is going on here at the farm as we move into our winter growth season. But before we get into today's video folks, if you wouldn't mind, if you're new here to the channel, please consider subscribing. YouTube is age restricting a lot of our videos so you're not going to be able to see our entire catalog unless you're subscribed and have a YouTube account. For those of you that have already subscribed, thank you so much for supporting our channel. If you guys wouldn't mind please give the video a big thumbs up before you exit out and if you guys are looking to support our farm any further please check out our website link in the description below now before we dive into all the stuff that's going on here at the farm as we move into our winter grow i have to give a big shout out to two of today's sponsors first and foremost mars hydro they've been sponsoring the farm for a while now uh, so go ahead and check out their website link in the description below we'll be going into the grow room later on in the video uh, you can use code YRC to save yourself some money and help out the farm. But we have a big announcement today for a second sponsor for the farm going into the winter grow. And what better way to announce our new partnership with New England Compost. As you can see, I'm wearing their hat today. And I have a little bit of a sign here to show you what we're going to be using for our winter grow. We're going to be doing an entire grow with just New England Compost soils. I'm really excited to work with these guys. You know, I know in the past we've worked a lot with Coast of Maine. We've championed Coast of Maine. Uh, we have a big sign down on our grow and we've worked with all their soils and amendments. But for the winter, we're really gonna go back to our roots. You know, we go look back at soil wars and we looked back all the things that we've tried in the early part of this farm and this channel. And we've really kind of gotten away from it and focused in on making better plants and using things that we really like but we've lost the spirit of experimenting. Now we have worked with New England Compost in the past and I'm really excited to work with them again on a full grow with their soils. I was really impressed with the samples that they've sent us in the past. So we're gonna go full in with them. I have a little sign here kind of describing what soil we're gonna be using. We're gonna be using the 203 potting soil, the high potency soil. There's a little excerpt about it. This will be hung in our grow room. so. You'll be able to catch it on most of the videos as we as we kind of move on into the winter grow with this new soil company. If you guys are interested, if you're in the Northeast, you know, the New England area, uh, check these guys out. Try to get them to your local stores. We're also trying to help them out to come down here to Virginia. So if you guys are in Virginia and you want to see them, please leave a comment on the video. We're trying to see and gauge how much enthusiasm there is for a new soil in the area. So those are a big announcement for today. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go down to the grow. I'm gonna show you the aftermath of harvest, what all the stumps look like, you know, what the telltale signs that you can tell just from looking at those stumps, the health of those plants. And then we're gonna close out the video, of course, in our grow room with all of our mother plants just chilling out in there. So let's get down to the grow. Let's look at some stumps. Let's end up in the grow room before we finish it out. So let's go take a look. So here we are at the old grow. As you can see, everything is long gone now. But one of the things I wanna come over here and show you guys is, is the aftermath of the harvest. And I really go around and I like to look at the stumps. And I left this one right here to kind of show you something we ran into this year. Now, as you can see, if you look really closely in there, you can see mud tubes. And those are termites. And I noticed that when we were harvesting the plants, that some of them were hollow. And now going down to the actual stump, you can see why a lot of those plants were small on this row. We had some termite issues. So I kept this as kind of like an example of what can go wrong during a grow and you have no idea that it's going on. The plants managed to give us a nice harvest, but they could have been way bigger. And we come down here to this monstrosity of a stump. Now you can see the termites even got to this one too. But this is a big cherry wine stump. Thing is huge. This is probably the biggest stump we had on the farm this year. You can just tell a lot with the health of the plant. If you come over here, now you can see that this one is a completely healthy plant. There was nothing wrong with this one. Same thing goes with this guy. So I really wanted to just share that information with you. Uh, when we come through the grow before we pull up the mats, I always look at the stumps. It tells you so much about the plants. 
uh, that you just really don't know until you see it for yourselves. And uh, I guess lesson learned, we're going to have to figure something out with termites uh, in the next couple years. But let's go check out the grow room before we close out the video. So here we are at the Mars Hydro grow tent. And as you can see, everybody is looking good now. Everybody's lush and green. Uh, two weeks total of recovery for most of the plants. This guy is still struggling a little bit, but for the most part, all of them have recovered fully and are growing really, really well. A lot of green in here. And as you can see, we moved in some vegetable plants. Um, and we'll be and we'll be doing something with them. They'll come out of the here in a little bit. Uh, we brought them in here to avoid the frost, so we'll see how they go. But for now, everything is looking great, and we're really excited to get the new grow started here in the next couple of weeks. And I'm really going to try to do a live stream uh, to give everybody an update on everything that's going on here at the farm. But folks, that is it for today. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you guys have any questions about today, leave a comment on the video. I would appreciate it. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. If you need to get in touch with me, Facebook, Instagram, and of course email. Check out our website link in the description below to support the farm. And as always, Mars Hydro is down there as well with code YRC. Save yourself some money, support the farm. I'll catch you next time, folks. I hope you all stay happy, healthy, and I will see you in another video.